have a question. I wonder if you could help me answer it. The problem I see is we think we have time. Why do we think we have so much time? Not time to complete our purpose or goals. Not time to do the work of the ministry. Not time to grow our families and do healthy, productive things. But time to waste. Why do we think we have so much time? God has given us a blueprint for our lives. He's given us instructions. He's guided our steps so that we could become prosperous in him if we follow the instructions. But we think we have time. Time that we don't have. Go to the ant, thou slugger. Consider her ways and be wise. Which having no guide, overseer, or ruler, provided her meat in the summer and gathereth her food in the harvest. How long wilt thou sleep, O slugger? When wilt thou rise out of thy sleep? So why are we still wasting time? Why are we wasting this precious, finite amount of time that we have? doing everything but the things that bless us why are we focused on people places and things that are not helping us grow but actually helping us to destroy ourselves why why are we so distracted what happened to our focus what happened to our goals and dreams why did we become so complacent why? Ecclesiastes chapter 3. To everything there is a season and a time to every purpose under the heaven. A time to be born and a time to die. A time to plant and a time to pluck up that which is planted. A time to kill and a time to heal. A time to break down and a time to build up. A time to weep and a time to laugh. A time to mourn and a time to dance. A time to cast away stones and a time to gather stones together. A time to embrace and a time to refrain from embracing. A time to get and a time to lose. A time to keep and a time to cast away. A time to rend and a time to sow. A time to keep silence and a time to speak. A time to love and a time to hate. A time of war and a time of peace. When I was a child, I spake as a child. I understood as a child. I thought as a child. But when I became a man, I put away childish things. Today I come to encourage you to put away everything that is wasting your time. You will look up in 10 years, 20 years, 30 years will have come and gone. And you would not have accomplished your goals. It is time for us as the body of Christ to raise up and do something about everything that's going on around us. It's time for you to walk in your purpose. It is time for you to achieve your goals. You can do it through Him. But you're going to have to make some changes. You're going to have to let some things go. You're going to have to choose to trust Him and give him your time versus doing what you've been doing and that's losing time.